So last time we talked, Alexis Ketter, the founder of My Legacy Challenge, aged up her new gremlin, Nicole Volkov, from a baby to a toddler. Jacob Volkov decided to pursue Molly Prescott as a potential love interest. And Alexis finally told the kids about the engagement, as well as asked them to participate in the wedding ceremony. OMG! Patchy has come to life. Out of all members of the household, you decide to talk to that booger eater. Oh damn, why are you yelling at her? He has the mean trait. I guess that makes sense. He is a scarecrow. Since most of the kids were older now, Alexis thought it was finally time to do something for herself. She hadn't partied in a while, ever since Jacob's birthday. So she decided to go to the club in Windenburg. Malcolm Landgrub is working the bar. Or did mommy and daddy cut you off? Alexis needed friends besides Christopher. So she decided to scope the club for friendly faces. She approached a sim with pink dye in her hair. She found out her name was Candy Bear. It was clear she loved to party. She got to know Candy, finding out she has the cheerful, outgoing, and music lover traits. Um, who asked you to butt into the conversation? Alexis also noticed a fellow werewolf at the club, Lou Howell. Candy, Lou, and herself had quite the conversation, which was ultimately cut short due to Alexis's fury. The second she got back home, she rampaged. The next day, Autumn to decided she needed friends. She went to the park and invited a girl she met at school named Shanna Kealoha. Damn bitch, why are you so pink? Autumn and Shanna couldn't stop talking. They talked about school, told stories, and monkeyed around. They had fun playing on the jungle gym and taking selfies. They had so much fun that they decided to become best friends forever. Why is this kid blue? Do any of these mongrels have normal skin tones LMAO? Meanwhile, at home, Nicole worked on her skills, and Alexis and Christopher were finding it harder to keep themselves off each other. At nightfall, Alexis got a call from Wolfgang Wilder, the dude she hooked up with a long time ago. He wanted to come over and see her. She agreed. Yo! Why are we screaming? What's so horrifying? OMG, Wolfgang's an elder now. Wolfgang sat Alexis down. He told her that he didn't have much time left and needed to confess his love for her before he dies. Alexis was appalled. They only woohooed once. Why was he so attached? Alexis told him that the circumstances changed nothing. Her heart was with Christopher and that he must take their secret to the grave. This upset Wolfgang, which she hated, but ultimately made her wonder. Wonder, will Wolfgang keep their secret forever, or will he spill the deeds to Christopher? 